Miss Monkey 1000. I went to uh, went to the store the other day. I'm not going to say where. You guess. Anyway, so I found this. And I thought maybe it might work for my phone in the truck while I'm, I'm going to work and stuff. So I can see my phone better when the office calls me and stuff like that. So it's, it's an As Seen on TV product. And it's called the Clever Grip Pro. And it's supposed to also, it, it's supposed to hold your phone, but also it's supposed to keep it cool. So, um, my phone doesn't really overheat, but sometimes if it gets low on a battery and I have the charger in, it, it'll get hot. So, uh, this is kind of cool, I think. Hopefully it'll work. And we're going to find out how to open this up and we're going to find out what we're going to do here. I'm going to take it over into the truck over there and um, we'll hook it up and see how well it works. Yeah. So, as soon as I can open this up. I should have brought me some scissors, but I got my keys. Keys work, right? So, hopefully. Yeah, let's see if I can get this open here. There, I got one side. Uh, this was, I think it was nine, uh, nine ninety-eight, something like that, I believe. Um, I got it at Walmart, so uh, wasn't gonna tell you, but you sure guess. So here we go. Let's see what we got here. Oops! There it goes on the floor. Ooh. Stay tuned. Okay, so. And we got this little little tiny thing here. And I guess this is hooks up to your air vent in your vehicle. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. So I'm trying to figure out how this is going to work because I have a cover on my case. So I don't know if that's going to work or not. But what I did, Shea Bear let me use his old phone that's broken just in case it falls that I'm not going to hurt my my phone. So um, so we're going to try it with his phone. But his it doesn't have the cover on it so I don't know. We'll see how it works here. And you get this other little thing, I guess, and you tape this wherever on your truck. Ooh, magnet, see? Got a magnet there. So they're going to connect. So I take it you put this on your phone, and then you click it on. That's how, how it's going to work. All right. And they give you directions here. I got some directions here. Let me see. Well, they give you two. Maybe this is, oh, okay. This one is your directions on how to put it on. Um, here's the English. Got your English here. And this is a, an agreement. I'm not going to read it. If you want to pause it or read it, you can. So it's kind of an agreement thing. Huh. Probably, I don't know. Pizza Hut driver just drove by. Hmm. Love pizza. So, anyways, it's a step one: squeeze to open the clip. So we have a clip back here, as you can see, and I guess it goes this way. It'll go like that. And you just clip it on. Open it up. Ooh. There it goes. Okay. So you open it up and you're going to put it on your air vent. Squeeze open the clip. Insert the Clever Grip Pro into the air vent of your car. Place the back of your phone against the magnet surface and it will hold the phone in place. Make sure the back of your phone case is free of oil. So you can use your phone case. So that's good to know. Use free of oils, dust and dirt. Wipe the surface with moist lint free cloth or alcohol wipe. I think I got an alcohol wipe in the truck. for, So I could use one of them. P 
peel the paper back from the metal disc and place the adhesive side on the back of your phone case. Press and hold for a few seconds to make sure it it stays, you know, a heaves. A heaves, that's what it means. So, I might not be able to use this phone then because I want this on my phone. So, that's what you're going to do. You're going to put this on the back of your phone. And then we're going to put this in the truck. And we're going to see how well it works. So, stay tuned. We'll be right back. We're gonna take. Hey, I wasn't ready. Go ahead now. Huh? <laughs> Boy, I just just hit the button. You're going okay, guys. Okay, guys. We got. I'm gonna use my phone instead of his because I gotta put this thing on the back of my phone. So I don't think it's gonna transfer. Once it's stuck, it's probably stuck. So I'm going to use my alcohol wipe here that I have and wipe the back of it. And it said it can use it on the case. So, that would be good. Because I was sitting there going, how is this going to work on a case? Well, this is how it's going to work. So, I want to make sure it's good and clean. It's supposed to make sure you don't have any oils or anything on it. Okay, let it dry for a few minutes. And then we're going to peel this off. Probably center it in the middle, like so. What you get? What are you getting Thursday for in here? It's gonna be up here. Parts for the car. Parts. What are they called? Calib camera. Oh, I'm getting a new camera. Oh yes, yes. I thought you meant the parts for the car, the truck. No. Well, get yeah. those too. Yeah, but yeah. Because we need to take care of our old girl here. Yeah, but yeah. we're getting a new um, dash cam. Yeah, we're going to get a new dash cam because he wants to use the other one for his computer. So, and I really missed it the other day because there was a really good car accident that I could have filmed it. So, so we got another one and it, this one's going to do everything. So, back and front. Yeah. Well, so, it, 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 it'll be facing you. It'll not, be. Not, yeah, it won't film the back of the truck. Why do I need it to face me? Like, it will take pictures, like, of accidents or whatever when I'm driving, right? Yeah, it'll yeah. film that and oh. you. Oh, okay, cool. That'll be fun. Okay, so I think we're dry now. i got to put my glasses so on. So you can drive down the road and vlog. And... Yeah, that'll be nice. Yeah, I can do some vlogging on my adventures during the day. Because sometimes I see some stuff. <laughs> yeah. So, anyways, we're going to peel this off maybe and we're going to stick it on here all right it's not too easy to just peel off but i guess it has to be strong right okay so we're going to take this and try to put it in the middle right about there and stick it down okay and peel the paper back Piece of side in the back of your phone case. Press and hold for a few seconds uh, to make sure it it stays. So I'll hold it down for a few minutes, and I think it'll be good. There we go. Because this magnet seems to be pretty pretty strong, huh, babe? Yep. So then, what you're supposed to do. I had trouble pulling that apart too. It's hard. So you put it like this, I guess, where you want it on your vent. Like so. And I don't want it too close because I want to be able to see it and be able to. Yeah. So there you go. Kind of. I don't know. On there, right? You think? And. That's it. You just clip it on there. Now, just like that picture. And then you put your cell phone on there. Ready? Yep. Here we go. Ooh. Whoa. Yeah. Not bad. 
it's a little heavy you can feel it go down so that means I maybe I might need to oh, it comes apart okay maybe move it up a little bit more up in the top so when it comes down because of the weight you know it might not there yeah it takes your vent down that's the only problem so because my phone's heavy but I don't have a big phone see it came right off I don't know if I like this or not because I'll be going over bumps I, I do dirt roads too sometimes you know I'm I go to back roads and stuff that's a little bit better now is it gonna fall I don't know so about this can you leave that vent yeah you got the vent open so there we go yeah, not too bad you need to go drive around and see how well it works go for a little drive how about that and we'll see we'll go over a few bumps and uh, see if it'll stay because I don't want it to you know, to fall. I mean, there are, are potholes and stuff like that. So, um, we'll try it. So, we'll be back. Okay, we're going to go for a little ride. And my assistant is holding the camera. So, I have my hands free. And this is good because I have wireless um, headphones that I use. That I can use for my phone. If someone calls me and I'm drive, driving down the road, then I can um, have my hands free. So I'm not touching it. So I have earbuds that I can use. Most of the time it's the office that's calling me or if there's an emergency or something like that. So that's what, you know. Because I drive for an hour to go from one patient to that. So it can be a long trip. And of course, you know, as soon as you drive, you're going to get a phone call. Always. So, anyways, we'll go down the couple of roads and we'll see how well it stays on there. Um, there's a lot of potholes through here. So maybe we can, I don't want to go in them too badly though, because of my tires. But for a little drive Let's see how it works seems pretty good so far yeah, we're just coming down our road well, where we live on uh, I've taken the tape off the park all the tapes off so I guess they're allowing people to just swing again and climb Not too bad. I don't, I don't think there's too much of a problem. Not yet. We'll see. <coughs> there you go. Now this road's a little rougher. They got patches here. They seem to. Yeah. See. Yeah, that's holding so far. Does it come off? It is moving a little bit, but not too badly. It's holding its magnet. Jesus. Yeah. I know. I try not to go back here, but it is a shortcut. A lot of people use this road for a shortcut to go into town. That clunking noise will be fixed. That's another part that's coming in Thursday. That clunk in their hair. Oh, you got that too? Huh? You got that one too? What? The clunking. The bushings. Yeah. 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 They'll help. be in Thursday. Yeah. Yeah. That's the clunk in there here. Yeah. So they'll have to watch my channel for that. That'll be good. So we'll go down here because this is a winding road and it's kind of bumpy. I think there's a couple of dirt roads maybe I can turn down and see if it um, will come off or not. So you certainly don't want it to come off because if it falls, it could break very easily. Just take a little ride. They got the doggy park open. Oh. 
Oh, somebody selling plants. That was a place that we did a video on. Very interesting place. Kind of sad, really. A lot of money in there that's just sitting there. Wish I had money because I buy it. That would be a good investment, I think. So we're going down this road. Now this road has some bumps and but it's pretty smooth. This is taking us towards the lake that we have showed you a few times on our videos. Huh? What? No lake. What do you mean no lake? There's no lake down there. Um, the river. Yeah. The river. It's the with the Coochie River. Not the lake. The river. So that place is an abandoned place. There's a couple of them down here we'd like to get into. <laughs> We could just take a little drive and go down here. So far, so good. It is jiggly a little bit. You know. Is it the truck? Or is it the road? Could be both. I don't know. But it's holding its own. I mean, it's still on there, so. It's moved a little bit. You see that? It jiggles a little bit, it moves a little, but it, it's still there, it's still holding on. So that's a good thing. I don't want to bother people. <laughs> Wondering what I'm doing down here. Because <laughs> it's dead end road. So, anyways, there's some pots and stuff here. So. And of course, you know, you're not going to go fast on this road anyways because it's, you know, full of potholes and stuff. It's not good on your vehicle, so you want to go as slow as possible. That's pretty much normal. I'm quite pleased with it. I think it's going to do what I want it to do for me. What do you think, babe? It's hanging in there. Yeah. No, it's hanging in there. It is smooth, though, going over something. But, I mean... Going over. Oh. Airboat bridge. Yep, airboat bridge. Yeah. Got several of them around here. Yep. Yeah. People like to use 
use their airboats here a lot. A lot of fun. Got a new house we built. I think it, it's going to work pretty good. I had a, one that had a cup and it went in your cup holder and then it expanded him about, about that height. And it worked good, but it eventually broke. Now, I don't know how long this is going to last. And, you know, we'll see. It is a bell and howl. Yeah. So. Which they make a lot of camera equipment, too. Oh, do they? Yeah. I had a bell and howl uh, night shot camera. Great for ghost hunting, except for one thing, it was always focusing. It was always trying to focus, even sitting still at nothing, it would focus. Right. Uh, other than that, I mean, the clarity, the mic was good. Mm -hmm. but uh, for basic driving, I think this will be just fine. So it is a name brand. Did you give them the price? Uh, I believe it was $9.98. Yeah. yeah. At Walmart? Yeah, at Walmart. And you can probably get it at online too, somewhere wherever other stores. But I'm quite pleased for for the price. I mean, you know, the one I paid for the cup holder was a little bit more expensive. It lasted a year and then it, it broke. And it's mostly where you tilt it that it broke out. So I didn't buy. I bought two of them and then they and I had I had enough of them both broke in the same spot so they had a weak spot on them so but this is kind of nice and it also what it does it keeps your phone cool so in the hot summer when I'm driving it, I get a lot of sun on the truck so it should keep if it we have to cool. I can put your piece of plastic in here yeah that comes out and we can clip that just for that clip so. yeah that would be cool. But it seems to be fine. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it does block the air conditioner. I could move it over here when I'm by myself. And maybe that, and then I have the, more of the air coming at me. Put that one over there, too. Yeah. Well, because on this style, these older styles, there's not a lot to clip to. Now, like these newer styles, there's more of a clipping spot for it. Yeah. So, yeah, but it will keep your phone cool. That's good. Which is essential down in Florida. You put that phone up there, oh. go in the store for an hour and come back, your shit ain't gonna be working. Nope. You've done that almost. You've saved I've your left, phone a I've couple of times. I've left my phone up there, yeah. Yeah. Not thinking. You get in, I set my phone up there. Yeah. And uh, it gets super hot. People from Arizona know what we're talking about. <laughs> Don't you guys? Yeah. yeah. California, Arizona, Nevada, yeah. Florida, yep, Texas, they get hot too. Yeah. That'll be good for me. For work. For a trip. And I can still use the charger, plug it in. It's good. Yeah, because we got your power outlets working. Yeah, and they're back there, so. I got my cord right here. Two power outlets there, yeah. one up there. Quick shaver got in. working for you. Yep. That makes my life a little easier. Yeah, I think it works quite well. It has not come off yet. And we went over quite a few bumps. Yeah. And this is rough here. Yeah. Because the damn semi is coming down through here when they're not supposed to. Yeah. Cutting through here. Yeah, they've ruined this road. Yeah. These are pretty big bumps. I don't know how well the camera's picking it up, but I'm sure you can hear the truck. Yeah. It's, uh. And I'm doing 20, so. Pretty rough road. Uh, it's hanging on pretty good, huh? Mm -hmm. I wouldn't be racing. I mean, you know, you're not supposed to anyway. So. Well, let's not talk about expensive. I hate when people do that. Let's yeah. jump this gorge and see yeah. if it stays on there. Come on. 
That's why we test everything in the situations we're going to be using it in. Right, you know, right, because they're, they're normal, and that's what these are made for, for normal activities, not, not going crazy. So, there you go. Um, Go back down our street. Just jiggle a little bit, but that's not bad. Oh, yeah, but it's not like you're gonna be sitting there looking at that for any reason, because you should not be. No, no. Anything's going to jiggle. I mean, look at this. Yeah. Look at it. You know, I mean, yeah. so you shouldn't be looking at that. You should be looking up there anyhow. So if it jiggles, it jiggles. Yeah. My concern was it going to fall, and it hasn't yet, so that's a good thing. No, it ain't fell on, on this trip, so it's not going to. Yeah, pretty good. Pretty good magnet, I think. It's pretty strong. Treehouse. Mm -hmm. Showing them the treehouse. So, <laughs> and there you go. You had a tour, a little tour. Yeah, we'll do it sometime. We'll take them out for a drive when things get better. And yeah. when we we'll get your new camera, if it works good, it's supposed to be 1080p. So that'll be fun. Front and rear facing, and then you can vlog mm -hmm. when you're going down the road vlog because it'll be facing you and out there and I can split screen for you. That'll be fine. You'll be talking well, showing people what. That'll be good. Yeah, yeah I can do some vlogging because I got some really cool well, places. Well, you asked me about mounting the camera up here somehow. Yeah. So I thought, well, this is front and rear facing so you can do your vlogging. It'll be recording you and also recording what's up front too. Cool. So I'm, uh, I'll be able to do some vlogs in my travels. All right. So what do you think of it? I like it. I, I really, I like it. So I think it'll do exactly what I want it to do. It, it, it has so far. So I think, you know, can't complain. Not at all. So for the price, I think the price is pretty good. I don't think it's expensive. And, you know, it works really well. And it comes off, goes on. No problem. So, whoop, did that. It's okay, I explained yeah. that, Because, huh? yeah. see, this is not very deep. Deep. That's why yeah. I said if we have to, I'll mount you a little piece of plastic up here that yeah. this, this piece here can clip on to. Yeah. It's well, maybe the deal. newer vehicles, too, are um, clip better. You that, know, well, I mean. yeah, that's what I explained to them yeah. for you, that they... That they're deeper, yeah, yeah, than these older ones. They'll go in farther. Yeah, but I mean, if you close this a little bit, it gives you a little bit more inside there. Mhm. Mm but like I said, if we have to, I'll mount you a little piece of plastic up here wherever you want it. Mhm. Mm and you'll be fine. Yeah. But yeah, I think for the money, it's good. I like it okay so that's it for now guys um i don't know what we're gonna do next um we have a couple of unboxing to do together unboxing well to to do to review yeah to review my fan mail because i already did the unboxing on this yeah I know it's you uploading did. now yeah you but, did that yeah yeah, so, we'll so maybe do, we'll do a review. I might do a hot sauce, frozen hot sauce thing. Hot oh, yeah? sauce sickle. Oh, okay. <laughs> Two, so we'll All see. right, we'll see. Okay, so Monkey says she's out for now. Y'all have a good week, and stay tuned. There will be a lot more videos coming. Bye, y'all.